Hello folks, it's Kikoski here and welcome back to Let's Replay Icewind Dale the Enhanced Edition. And wait last, we left off. Our party is trying to make their way to the Dragon's Lair so that we can slay them and prevent them from killing everyone in the ten towns. We're currently inside this cave that was being guarded by ice sentries. They weren't ice. They were hit very hard, and we had to reload because they killed our troop. But we got past them, and now we're here. Now I need to see if there are going to be any more enemies in our near future in this area, and the answer is no. That looks like a massive skeleton, though. A massive, massive skeleton. And I want to check out this area before I move on. The answer is... What's over here? Nothing! Okay, just enemies. Right, let us keep moving. This, by the way, leads to the first level. There are probably many, many levels to this dungeon. And we will step forth into the next encounter that will basically be full of trolls and scrags. And are we going to be walking on the remains of this creature? I think we are. Hmm? Uh, no problem. I think we are. Oh, hello! It's just one of you. On that uh, narrow path, it would be difficult to fight multiple foes, which is why I decided to lead them to the more open area. Just take care of you. I'm actually going to use burning hands on you, I think. I'm going to kill this one and then just use burning hands. Bring it on. There we go. One burning hands. Excellent. Saves us a bit of money. Because we're going to have to buy all those arrows back that we use. We're going to have to buy them back. I have to watch out though. I only have 173,000 money. It's nowhere near enough. Okay, so there is a bridge that has been built there. And no way that we can go this way. Okay. So we need to go over this bridge that might be trapped. I am going to be careful. There could be a trap on it. There's a cold bones. Oh! Undead! I should have really expected that. How tough are these cold bones? And how quickly can I destroy them with turn undead? Oh dear! There are also iced bones that are firing spells at me. Well, that's unfortunate. Uh, I need you to fire this here. That. Oh, that's an ice storm. Uh, that's an ice storm. Get back. Get back from the ice storm. Ice storms are no joke. What is your will? Okay, the enemy appear. Okay, I was about to say the enemy appear Ready. unwilling to follow, but they're following. They are absolutely following. And uh, you're there. Good. Let's go to uh, I actually right want here. you to shoot this foe. What would you have of me? And you to engage here. I am needed. Are you out of spells? Yes. I hope you're out of spells. Yep, you you appear to be wholly out of spells. I'm here. Perfect. What is done? I think we can now deal with these quite capably. Also, you have magic shields as loot. That they're plus one shields. That is Ah, you're a threat. You're a frozen bones. Okay, that that has much further reach than I thought it did. Kill you now. Then kill the other one. Okay, we got a level up from that. We got two level ups from that. That's amazing. Also, you do emit a aura of cold, which is not fun. And you two are just not having any fun at all, which suits me just fine. Oh, do not go forward. Was that a third level up? That was a level up for our fighter. Marvelous. Okay, I think it's safe now. And this is when we suddenly take 
No, we got four level ups. Speak. We got four level ups there. Okay, um, heal on you because you're nearly dead. And heal thyself, healer. Otherwise, you'll die. And we don't want that. Everyone else didn't take that much damage. As for treasure, we have like a plus one buckler and a couple of gems. It's not even a high quality sword. But we know this is a small shield plus one. And we know that these gems are worth a trifling amount of coin. Let us save before we do our level ups, just in case I do something critically wrong. It's not like I'm going to do anything critically wrong. Okay, first off, we have you. Who still doesn't get another proficiency point, because I want to get you to five in two-handed swords. But a Thacker reduction is always nice. Then we will get a level up for you. Uh, additional, well, just an additional spell for everything. All right. Just one additional spell, period. Uh, we'll get a protection from evil prepared. We'll get a... Uh, get another aid spell. We'll get a... Remove curse. Remove paralysis. Not protection from fire. Because if anything, we're not going to be facing fire, are we? Um, how about... A zone of sweet air. I get the feeling we might need that. Uh, oh boy! Protection from evil 10 foot radius. That seems like a really good one for me to have. Uh, also a... Righteous Wrath of the Faithful? Uh, chaotic Commands, though, could be good. And 6th level. We have Physical Mirror. We have Physical Mirror. Bounces missile weapons backwards. Uh, Entropy shield might be nice. Wondrous recall, no. Spiritual wrath. Uh, mm, no, we're not going to be casting that because that would only affect, uh, or rather, only be resisted by evil. Creatures. And we'll have a conjure animals. Because you yes. know what? Why not? Also, level up for you. Fourth, fifth, and seventh level spell. Ooh. Mist of Eldeth. Hmm. That's any creature, which is a bit of a problem. Uh, creeping Doom. Command Earth Elemental. Firestorm. Firestorm might be nice. And finally, you. Uh, you get an additional 7th and an... Ooh, an 8th level spell. Ooh, okay. There are lots of really good 8th level spells out there. Pierce Shield is quite nice. That lowers magic resistance. Um, however, there's Horrid Wilting. This body, this spell evaporates moisture from the bodies of every living creature within the area of effect, inflicting 1d8 points of magic damage per level of the caster. Affected creatures are allowed a save. Water-dwelling creatures are instantly destroyed if they fail their saving throw. Are we been facing Sahuagans? We have been facing Sahuagans. So you know what? That might actually be a good spell to learn. And if we get another level, we'll then take Pierce Shield. Uh... Yeah, we're going to take Horrid Wilting. Uh, we're going to take Horrid Wilting. I think that's a pretty good idea. Let's go to work. As far as spells go, I, I've seen the writing on the wall, and Horrid Wilting is... Well, it's a horrid spell. I mean, it's in the name. Horrid. It is pretty horrible. Okay, any more threats we need to worry about over here, please no. Oh, there's a bone scavenger, but I bet you can't get over here. No! No, you cannot. Ready. Easy as you problem. cannot get over here. Okay! Hello! Your model's a bit too big for this, so we're... I mean, never mind the fact that you can fly, and you should just be able to fly over the gap. Mechanically, you still have to follow the bounding boxes of right the terrain, and all? so we were easily able to cheese that fight. Okay, I'm a little concerned. Okay, that's a second one, and that one is not so bound, but yes, bring it on. there's loot here. 
You are not sure what kind of creature this skeleton belonged to. This appears to be the skeleton of a beholder. Oh, interesting. There's all kinds of skeletons here. And loot! We have a wand and some scrolls. We have... Some stuff here, and also you. I mean, I'm not going to say no to the treasure. This is probably where the bone scavengers called home. I say called home because they're dead now. Uh, let's pass these over to you and see what they are. And we'll also put these in here. We have a amulet of protection plus one. Eh. A wand of lightning. Mm. And chainmail plus two. Eh. Chainmail plus two is a lot less interesting than you'd think. Hey, you need me? And there is... Ooh, there's mm. more. Not a problem. There's one here and that there. Yes, but what's this? A pile of gold. What's this? Gems. Huh. I won't say no. I won't say no to gems, especially an emerald. Emeralds right. are worth a fair bit of coin, so that's all of that. Right Hello! I have, right by the way, left a person behind, haven't I? Yes, I've just left Kor standing you, there looking at the insist. scenery. Hey, you need me? I feel like what I probably it? shouldn't have. Right I also here. feel like I should be attacking you in melee, because realistically, you're not that dangerous. You look like a wyvern, but you don't have the poison barb of the wyvern. Either that, or it's DC is so poor that it's not hit us yet. Yeah, there's quite a few of these. And there's another body that we can loot. Excellent. Not a problem. Oh no! More of you. Okay, I need to be very mindful of a spellcaster when they turn up. Like you. I'm just gonna fire off a fireball over here. Note, by the way, that Horrid Wilting was living creatures. That'll help. That helped a lot. Oh, that helped a lot. Okay, hit you. Oh, that, that did hurt, though. However, that should that should help out a fair bit. Yeah, that should help out a fair bit. Okay, you're killing this one. You're nearly dead. Okay. Excellent. I think we can just about wrap this up now. You're also taking a lot of harm. Good thing we have these potions. I'm here. And bad thing that we have all of that to worry about. Okay. Uh, move back, you. And move back. Okay. Kill you. And then kill you. Because you're the ones that are causing the cold effect. I'm here. You really have no clue. And then we should be alright. Yeah, we're okay. We're okay. There we go. Another plus one shield, though, for our massive piles of wealth. These are really not that difficult once you deal with the spell casting. Also, we have a normal small shield. That's barely worth picking up. You'll notice that I have stopped picking up certain things. There's really no reason to uh, pick up some of them. Oh, and if you're curious, yeah, it is a small shield. It could have not been. I mean, it very much could have not been. It could have been like a amazing shield of awesome, but it was. What? I'm actually going to transform you back into human form because healing. You do have access to healing. Might as well use it. Yeah, I remember that I have it. You do inherently just move faster. I don't know if that's intentional, but you do. Because if I use this spell... Everyone heals a bit. Which is economical in terms of actions. Good for combat, really. It's much more effective outside of combat to use focus spells, but there we go. 
greater werewolf form. We have multiple uses of that now. Ah, I see signs of habitation. And there will probably be more ice golem sentries. Ready. And then I will be sad. Also, there is loot. Yeah, good is done. This loot is... Ooh. Is that a ring of infravision? That's a ring of infravision. Oh, I know my second edition uh, item pictures. And a ring of protection poster. Ring of Infravision is not very good. It's a far cry from the uh, Helm of Infravision. Well, that, that there. True artifact of power. It's not really. It's not really at all. Put these away. Yes. And carry on forward. We'll probably find some more enemies that we're going to be really... Oh, hi! Really sad to see one of them's you! Right, how many spells do I have to deal with you? Plenty! Plenty. Yep, you're gone. Moving forward. Another skeleton of a beholder. Many have tried to call this place home, and most have failed. Most have failed. We are probably going to end up there at the end of this. This would be where this would be where I'd throw an encounter here. So actually, save, not cancelled. Back up, and I want you to scout forward sneakily. Yep. 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 Lone guard skeletons and Zactile. Huh. Huh. Ready. Interesting. You know what I'm going to do? I'm just going to fire a fireball under there. That's what I'm going to do. Hello. That hit some cold bones. There's probably more than those cold bones there. Hey, you need me? A lot what more than it? those cold bones there. But it did hit him. I'm here. What would you have of me? Is it just cold bones here? No, it's not just cold bones. I am anytime. It's not just cold bones. I'm hit this one. Ready? Alright, we need a fireball there. And then we'll need another fireball as well. Just to kill them. There we go. That'll help out a bit. Uh, kind of need you to stop there. Uh, that one is dead. So if you could now just focus these down, that'd be fantastic. Speak. Also, you can just turn. That'll deal with the lesser foes. Okay. Yep, that, that dealt with the lesser foes. It actually killed them. Just stone dead killed them. We have gone over a uh, power threshold. That just kills them now. Uh, stay there. No need to pursue. Okay, maybe we have a minor need to pursue. Nope, nope, we're good. We're good. Okay. Grab, grab, grab. And what did you drop? Nothing worthwhile. By the way, plus one shield. Just in case you were curious, it's a plus one shield. Yes. And we're going to try and rest here. Against my better judgment, we're going to try and rest. Turned out not to be against my better judgment. We were absolutely fine. That makes a change. I feel like this area is completely optional. I feel like this area is completely optional. I'm still going to check it out. I'm going to check it out. Maybe they... Maybe they serve... Ooh, if they serve... The also, this is a... This is a great worm's body. That's a big dragon. Is this her remains? I doubt it. I doubt it. She, she'd want to inhabit her remains. 
And so, when we come back, folks, we have this dragon's remains to look at. And maybe these Sahuagan have some information about this dragon. And maybe they don't want to kill me. I highly hope they don't want to kill me. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, for when we come back, descending even further into the realm of this long-dead white dragon. I'd like to think we can talk it out, but let's face it, no, that's not happening. And so, I'll catch you next time, folks, and I'll see you then. Later.